Can U.S. infrastructure keep up with the AI economy? The scale of AI data centers and their commensurate power needs are growing exponentially. By 2035, Deloitte estimates that power demand from AI data centers in the United States could grow more than 30-fold, reaching 123 gigawatts, up from 4 gigawatts in 2024. That's the figure that you're looking at right now. Just so you know, a regular Google search compared with an AI data search takes up to 10 times more electricity. As far as water consumption is concerned, a regular Google search might take less than one ounce of water. It's actually about a milliliter of water. Whereas that same AI search is going to take 16 ounces worth of water. Now, this is Alexander Wang of Scale AI. So the conservative estimates are that we need 20, uh, 20 gigawatts of power servicing data centers, which I think is about like five Chicago's worth of energy in the next, call it two or three years. And what are we doing as a result? Well, Amazon is building a new data center in Indiana that will use 2.2 gigawatts, enough to power 1 million homes. US data electricity has nearly tripled in a decade and could triple again by 2028. Microsoft admits that its goal of becoming carbon negative by 2030 is now in jeopardy. And although you have many technology companies committing to achieving their sustainability goals over the next decade, they're promising this with a caveat, that because AI will bring about efficiency and innovation, therefore we will reduce our power consumption. That's not something I'm betting on. AI poses a serious risk and challenge to our climate, energy grids, and overall how this world is wired. We're going to be putting mother nature to the test. Let me know your thoughts.